Welcome everyone. In this video, we'll be guiding you through the financial statement reconciliation use case using the Data Snipper platform. In this use case, we'll be reconciling financial statements with trial balances to ensure the completeness and correctness of internal figures. We do this because we want to avoid time-consuming data extraction and manual matching, as well as to obtain a faster output with higher quality. Regarding our steps in our use case, we'll first need to obtain a trial balance and financial statements for the period. Once we've done that, we will use document matching to reconcile the trial balance data with the financial statement data, as well as then inspecting the document matching output to verify the alignment and correctness between the trial balance and the financial statement figures. Now for our work in Excel, we would have a typical trial balance. This contains the data we need to match with the supporting documentation. Let's start by importing our financial statement. Once we've done that, and it's visible on the document viewer, we would go into document matching and start new document matching. The first step is to select the sample data, which in this case will be the class column as well as the balance column. Click Next. Select All Documents since we've only uploaded the financial statement, and click on Match All Rows. Document matching then provides us with all the matches that it has been able to find. As we can see, we do have some mismatches or incorrect matches, so let's go through them now. In our financial statement, we see that assets held for sale are being pulled from the incorrect location as well as other inputs. To account for this, we need to go back into document matching. And in the input-output table, we'll click on the three dots next to All Documents and select the Force Match Row of Table option. This will tell document matching to only match our inputs to outputs that are set in a line within the financial statement. Then for the Assets input, we need to select the Mandatory Field box so that document matching knows that it should find a match for that input first and only then search for a match for the rest of the inputs. Finally, for the amounts input, we would set a threshold of 1 so it accounts for differences in the values. Upon clicking on Match All Rows, Document Matching will now give us all the output according to our options, which we can see is now much more accurate. Our assets for sale is coming from the correct location, and it is no longer picking up any input that doesn't have a corresponding amount output. As we've seen for financial control, these reconciliation processes are quite consistent and done on a regular basis. So to automate this process, we simply have to go back into document matching, click on Save as Template, and give it a name. We'll call it FS Reconciliation. Now that template will be saved on My Templates tab within document matching. For the future, you'd only need to click on that template, and Data Snipper would generate a tab with all of the structure in Excel, where you'd simply copy over the information from your trial balance into that template. Upload your document and click on Match All Rows. Thank you for watching this video. Happy snipping!